This is Bob Orr in Washington. Law enforcement sources say Najibullah Zazi was at the center of a plot to use homemade explosives against one or more terror targets in New York. Now the FBI is pressing an urgent search for a core group of 9 to 12 other people associated with Zazi who may have knowledge of his plans. Sources say while some potential suspects have been interviewed and cleared, other names continue to surface as the FBI tries to fully understand Zazi's intentions. Officials have not confirmed any specific targets, but sources say the plot may have focused on mass transit, a favorite al-Qaeda target. A cell phone video found in Zazi's possession shows scenes of Grand Central Terminal and the discovery of nine new backpacks and some cell phones during those raids in Queens suggests an attack similar to the 2004 bombings of trains in Madrid in which cell phones were used to trigger backpacks filled with explosives. Sorry, no but most compelling to investigators is a file found on Zazi's computer. Nine pages of handwritten notes detailing how to build hydrogen peroxide and acetone bombs. Zazi carried that information, apparently received at that al-Qaeda training camp in Pakistan on last week's visit to friends in New York. While Zazi denies he's a terrorist or connected in any way to any plot, he is expected to be hit soon with more serious terrorism charges. And sources say other arrests are almost certain. Katie? Bob, we're in Washington tonight. Thank you, Bob.